first tonight, a local brewery is celebrating their anniversary in the capital city. Thanks for joining us. I'm Molly Pat. You probably know them, Happy Bassett Brewing Company. They're working in five years of business. And KSMT News reporter Cassie Nichols is live in South Topeka now. And Cassie, what's going on over there? Molly, tonight is all about having fun in the community. They have vendors, live music, and lots of food. And I'm told that they have some big plans for the future. Five years ago, the Happy Bassett Brewing Company opened their doors for the first time in the Topeka community, and since then they've grown. Uh, well, clearly quite a bit. <laughs> what started as a small brewery in southwest Topeka is now something much bigger after expanding to a second location, Happy Bassett Barrel House. We opened it last year right about the height of COVID. So, um, not going to lie, we got a little nervous there for a while, but actually having such a big venue kind of worked to our favor because we were able to do things still and, and still, you know, socially distance and do things like that. Now they call it their little dog empire, obviously because of the Happy Bassett name, but also quite literally. <laughs> the brewery, known for its beer, is also testing the waters with barbecue. We're building a smoker, full kitchen. This will be the best barbecue in Topeka next year. I guarantee you that. So it's a big challenge. Yeah, come out and try. We do potato salad, coleslaw, and we're trying some new things out too. Infusions with the beers. We're making our own mustards with our beers. With a combination like barbecue and beer, they say anything is possible. Officials at the brewery also say a live music amphitheater is going to be built in the near future. Live in South Topeka covering local news that matters, Cassie Nichols, KSNT News. All right, Cassie, thank you. I hope you make your way back here and don't stick around for all the fun over there. No, I have actually talked to the owners when they started construction on their second location that Cassie was just at. So we've got stories that follow their progress along all at KSNT.com. It's pretty fun to see where they started and how they grew and then where they're at now. So you can find those all on our website. And weather-wise,